Hi, everybody. For our first book, I chose Splatter by Diane Alber. This is a story of a colorful crew made from paint splatters of red, yellow, and blue. Each of them had an artistic flair with splotches and blotches and spiky wet hair. But this crew is different than most that you'd see. They each worked alone, not together as three. One color per drawing is how they each played, never knowing there could be a much better way. Then one lovely morning, Red gathered the crew and said with excitement, let's try something new. Instead of us each painting so far apart, why don't we work on the same piece of art? They loved the idea and yelled out, we're in. What do we do first? Where do we begin? They were so happy they all could finally agree. Then Blue shouted out, I'll go first, follow me. He began to create, but got carried away, painting raindrops all over so the rest couldn't play. The other two grumbled, this just isn't fair. We sat there waiting while you splashed everywhere. But Yellow decided to not be so glum. He still wanted to see what they could become. So he grabbed some fresh paper to start something new. But when he began, he forgot the rest too. He made a bright sun that filled the whole space, not seeing the frown that formed on Blue's face. I wanted to play too, he complained with a pout, but each time we try it, it just doesn't work out. I'm so sorry, Red, I know this was your dream, but as you can see, we can't work as a team. I know this is hard, said Red, but don't quit. We must try again. Please get up, don't sit. I know this will work. I believe in our crew. We'll make something great and we'll have fun too. I've got some more paper, Red smiled and exclaimed. When we finish our painting, it will surely get framed. We can do something simple. We can all use our powers. Have you ever tried painting a garden of flowers? Red and yellow always painted the sky. The garden was different and they were scared to try. Red tried to help and said, it's easy to do. If you paint circles, you can paint flowers too. Each petal's an oval, a circle stretched long. Now paint a whole bunch and you just can't go wrong. So they built up the courage to give it a shot. It's easy, Blue said, it's like painting a dot. Yellow was pleased and high-fived his friend Blue and to their surprise, they created green too. Soon they made orange from yellow and red, then violet showed too when red and blue spread. Next came indigo, a deep navy blue. It changed when violet dashed quickly past blue. But something was missing, the sky wasn't right. It was missing some color, it wasn't, it was just also white. So blue filled the sky and yellow made the sun and together they cheered, wow, teamwork is fun. Look what they created when they worked all together. The art was so beautiful, it was better than ever. The end. I hope you guys enjoyed our story. I'll post more soon, bye.